Hello and welcome to Danny Media TV. My name is Danny and today I'm going to be playing The Deep Well. This is another indie horror game and it's got some pretty good ratings so I'm kind of eager to play it. So let's go now. Oh god. Oh this is not very nice. Where the hell am I? Oh. I'm legit down a well. <laughs> okay, right, um, okay. Pick the highlighted item up by pressing E. Alright, I got it. And I actually feel like I'm in a well right now because it's dark again. So, uh, yeah. Use the left mouse button to interact with your currently selected item. You can turn your light source on and off. And also use health and stamina potions. You get potions in this game? Oh, wow. That's kind of cool. Alright, what do we got? Is this batteries? Nice. I'm liking the look of this game. The, the text is changing like seriously quick. <laughs> Sanity can be affected by monsters. In this case, just don't look at them and run for your life. What monsters? Press shift to run. Okay. Alright. Your goal is is always on the opposite corner of the maze. Alright, so, uh, there's a maze down here with me? Why? <laughs> oh god. Oh, well this is just peachy. Um, I'm not alone during this game, just to let you guys know. I've got, uh, an alcoholic beverage with me this time. It's, um, uh, it's actually really nice. It's, um, I keep hearing stuff. It's, uh, Evil Pumpkin Beer. I'm getting into the Halloween spirit this October. It's actually very, very nice. What's it got in it? This rich ruby ale is brewed with pumpkin and mace to add a gently warming seasonal spiciness. Hints of toffee and a luscious depth of dried fruit and caramel are perfectly balanced by complex hot flavors. It's the perfect Halloween treat. What am I talking about my... <laughs> Okay. And I'm running out of light. What am I doing? Oh, balls, alright. Recharge. That was kinda of stupid of me, I was telling you what I'm what I'm drinking. There could be a monster after me somewhere. How would I even know? I'm not too sure what the monsters are in this game as well. That's kinda of good, isn't it? Alright, I need to use my skills in escaping mazes. Oh, what? Um, right, I get it. So, uh, this is the monster of the maze, is it? A mannequin? No, 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 are you kidding me? It's like a, a weeping angel from Doctor Who. It's friggin' chasing after me. It's pretty quick, actually, as well. Every time I turn my back, he's there. Where is he now? He's like Slender Man. He actually looks like Slender <laughs> He looks like Slender Man. I've got to get out of here. Oh, what's this? A lighter and some batteries next to each other. I'm being treated today. Leave me alone. What happens if I touch you? Anyway, does it, like, um, do anything? No? All right. Stay away from me, mannequin. I don't like you. Uh, oh crap, there's a wall. Go this way. Oh! <laughs> I found it! I found the way out, baby. That deserves a celebratory drink. Mannequins! It all makes sense now. I had a friend who was a mannequin once. We, uh, went on adventures. Mannequin adventures. To mannequin islands. <laughs> Mannequin Islands, what am I on about? This is what happens when I drink, I come out of crazy stuff, man. What is this, another torch? Alright, I'll drop this one, and I will pick up a fresh torch. Using your brain. I just had an idea as well, I could probably pick up two torches. Elaborate on my whole using your brain theory. I'll drop that one. I'll pick this one up, I will use the batteries on it, 
and I'll pick this one up as well. So I've got two torches now and a lighter. I'm doing pretty good. Oh, that's my breathing, isn't it? I wondered what was going on just then. Like I could hear breathing and everything and it's me running out of breath because my character is seriously unfit. I haven't got a problem with mannequins, but I don't like being followed. I really don't. But a mannequin, that's not too bad. I, I, I can put up with that. If it was a, uh, a monster running after me, that would be a bit different. Especially if it was a mini minotaur. Mini minotaurs in this case are quite bad and I can hear something growling. Is that the mini minotaur? Where the hell are you, Tabuscus? No! <laughs> what do you want? What do you want? What do you want? What do you want? Can you guys see that? Crying out loud. Go away. Seriously. What do you want? I don't like this. <laughs> I really, really don't like this. The no I'll go away. I'll go away, go away. No! What are you? What the hell are you supposed to be? I'm being stalked by something, there are... I've got to go. I've got to go, man. I've got to go. There's a woman crying down here. And my guess is that she's not on my side. Because only crazy people go down wells. And consequently find a camera. Why is there a camera down here? I'll tell you what. Drop that and pick up the camera. Oh! Wow! <laughs> I got a camera! Nice! What is that? Oh, it's a... Is that a potion? What do what? What would I even need that for? Health? That's a red potion. Oh, I like this. <laughs> Although this kind of gives them an element of, uh... Horror to the game. I know it's already horror, but I don't like using this lighter for some reason. It gives it a, a more scary glow. I'm gonna leave the potion there. I don't need it at the moment. And it has gone seriously quiet right now. I gotta find the way out of here. Oh, damn it, that's a brick wall. I thought that was a huge monster then, but it's mist. Why is there like a, a ghostly mist down here? Oh wait, we're in a haunted well. It all makes sense now. There's a pair of eyes looking at me. A pair of massive, huge, white eyes. I've got to find a way out of here. Where's my torch? There we go, it's a bit better. It, it, it lights up further ahead, basically. Oh, balls. I haven't seen anything in a while. It's just been eyeballs, man. I don't mind that, though. And my character needs to work out some more. Why couldn't I have someone like, I don't know, Usain Bolt? Somebody who can sprint for miles and not even break a sweat. Not even break a leg, because his legs are made out of titanium. They have to be. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. The evil pumpkin beer is taking place in my system right now. That's another red potion. That's not the same one. I must be making progress. Alright, what's behind this? Anything? Nope, just another brick wall. I, I wondered what that was then. I was thinking, that looks really strange. Where's the way out of here? I don't even know how I ended up down here. Is this like a hobby of mine or something? How did this happen? How did I fall down here? Did I climb down here? Did I fall down here? Either way, I've got to get the hell out of here. I quite like that effect though, the, um, you know, the dents in the walls that are consequently down here. You can kind of see where you're going. And this camera's a nice touch, but not good for anyone with epilepsy, so don't watch this. 
I keep seeing eyes, and then they keep disappearing. What the hell? Can this battery die on you as well? I'm not too sure. This is kind of spooking me out right now. There's nothing here. I'm looking at the camera. <laughs> oh, whoa! Seriously, man. Who's behind me? Somebody keeps ganging up on me behind. Don't get any funny ideas. Doesn't sound that right either, does it? Where are these eyes coming from? As the, <laughs> the closer I get to them, they just disappear. And I kind of don't want to turn around just in case I see something. Where is the ladder? I've just got this horrible feeling that something's going to come and get me now. I've gone around in a circle, I think. I'm pretty sure of that. Well, maybe I haven't. Actually, yes, I have. Crap. What's going on? Why is the room filling up with blood? Torch, where are you? Oh my god. Now you're deciding to die on me? I thought we were friends, Torch. I thought we were friends. And yet you decide to do this to me? What are you on? I really like this game though. It's really, really scary, but it's so well done. I'll put a download link in the description, you can try it out as well. I'm not so sure how many floors there are to this um, well, but I've made it to one. I've made it past one floor. Maybe this is just never ending. In fact, this kind of reminds me of... Um, what does it remind me of? It reminds me of SCP-432. You get the impression? Ah, oh, seriously. I've got to get out of here. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm not interested in anything you're selling. Ghost down the well. <laughs> What's going on? Whoa, 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 whoa. What do you want? No! Run! What is that thing? I thought I was dead just then. No! No, leave me alone! Go away! Go away, go away, go away! Go away, go away! This is just take, taking creepy to a whole new level. Run. Seriously, I don't care if you're unfit. What am I doing? I just activated sticky keys. Uh, I, I just activated sticky keys. That was a serious, <laughs> serious fail. <laughs> That's my bad, guys. I didn't mean to actually do that. I was, I was, I was finger bashing the shift button, and now I'm screwed down here with a sticky keys box on my screen right now. Right. Well, that subsequently ends this episode. I'm gonna drink some more evil pumpkin beer. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and hope to see you all next time. Take care. The kind of sucks. No! You moron! I don't believe it! That was a freaking onyx! And somebody just killed it!